Acts 2, 17 through 21 talks about the outpouring of the Holy Spirit in the last days and God's sons and daughters prophesying and seeing visions and dreams. Um, and whoever shall call upon the name of the Lord shall be saved. Um, to, a couple of days ago, God gave me a vision of, I was in like, let's just say it wasn't Starbucks, but let's just say it was a place like Starbucks. I was trying to order some food or something with a group of people around like before COVID time where it was just people. Um, and I saw when I went outside, but I was in like the streets and there was shooting going on in the streets. New details for you tonight about the man accused in a deadly shooting spree in the West Valley that left 12 people hurt and one man dead. The suspect's name is Ashen, uh, Ashen Tricario. And this one's been making national headlines all day. Oh, I got hit in the leg in my, like by my kneecap, but it, when I looked down, it was just like maybe a bruise to show where I got hit, but it didn't go through. The first shooting on Thursday happened near 103rd Avenue and Northern, with witnesses reporting a man in a white SUV shooting a woman with her child in the back seat. That woman was sent to the hospital and is expected to be okay. So, um, I believe there'll probably be some shooting in the streets. I believe that, I mean, it was a lot of gunfire going on in the streets. Um, and I got hit, so I'm assuming other people got hit. Um, so maybe there'll be survivors. Then 15 minutes later, police responded to a man shot dead inside his car off Loop 101 near Thunderbird Road. Witnesses told police they saw the same white van and heard a pop. There were five more shootings. One of the victims actually pulled out a gun and shot back at Tricorico, but neither of them was hit. The biggest question, why would one young man try to hurt so many strangers, even killing one? And, and today is June 2nd. 2021 and I believe it was on Monday because today's Wednesday after I had the dream Monday morning I think um or I saw the news that night anyway shortly after I saw the dream I saw a shooting in the street where these uh, group of uh, people got out of a white vehicle and shot up some black some African American people I think it was in Miami, Florida, and I thought, I wonder if God is showing me a shooting that would take place, obviously, after the shooting that happened on Monday, which I believe was the 31st, because today's June 2nd of 2021. So I believe there will be some shooting, large, massive shooting, maybe machine guns in the streets. Um by somebody, someone, some sort of vehicle. like so Neighbors had seen the suspect coming and going from his home in recent days in that same white Volkswagen he was arrested in. So, like it could be, and this is just me, and I, I try not to do this at all, but like a semi-automatic or automatic weapon being shot at a group of people in the streets. I'm not sure. According to court records, Chikariko had an AR-15 in his car, which he used in the shootings. Investigators also say that he bought ammo at Cabela's right before he started doing the shootings after believing someone was following him at a car wash. I mean, I just want to pray. Father God, in the name of Jesus Yeshua, I just pray for a hedge of protection around us for that automatic shooting, that weapon that was used to kill, steal, and destroy your children. I pray for salvation, for us to be protected and surrounded by Psalms 91, that there will be no mass shooting with automatic weapons, firearms, army weapons against your civilians, your children, Father God. I pray that we would not see video footage of just death from automatic weapons because that was the, the way the gunfire was shooting. It was, it was automatic weapons, like high powered automatic weapons shooting at your children in the streets as we were ducking and diving as it was going back and forth. 
I pray for Psalm 91, for us to be wrapped in Psalms 91, for a hedge of protection to be around us, for the full armor of God. Father God, I got hit, but it did not puncture. It did not kill me. It did not blow my leg off. So I pray for, and I had nothing on my leg. So I pray for the supernatural hedge of protection around us that will ricochet bullets, Father God, where we can't explain why the bullet hit us, but it didn't puncture us or it didn't go through or didn't do what it could have done. For you are protecting your children, your laborers. I pray for the ones that if it, this does come to pass and it is our, our time to go, that their names were written on the land book of life. Father God, for your word says, do not boast that that um, spirits obey you, but that your name is written on the land book of life. I think I'm getting that right. So I just pray that we all have our name written in the land book of life in the name of Jesus, Yeshua. And I thank you for your angels, your warning angels, your guardian angels. Wrap us in um, Psalm 91 and 2 Timothy 1, 7. God did not give us a spirit of fear, but a power of love and of sound mind. And we cancel all second heaven activity and retaliation demon. We replace it with the, with, with the will of God to love. In Jesus' name, man.